welcome to another video. Walk on the wild side and I'm here in a sunny Blackpool. Check it out. I'm here by the central pier. There's a big wheel. All quiet at the moment. You know, the only thing I can hear right now is the roar of the Irish Sea. It's about half past seven in the morning and Blackpool is just starting to wake up. I can see a metal detector right out there. The tide is, well, it's it's quite far out, but I'll tell you what, it's making a right roar. I'll show you in a minute. Uh, but yeah, this video is a bit of a public information video. It's about the upcoming air show, 10th and the 11th of August, Saturday, Sunday, coming up. And uh, I wanted to let you know, give you some tips on where you can see the air show. You can actually see the air show anywhere along Blackpool Promenade, anywhere from the Pleasure Beach, right up to the North Pier and a bit beyond. But there is a certain area here where I am now, right in front of the tower, of course, between the Central Pier and the North Pier. This is going to be the main place. This is going to be where most of the people are. There's going to be thousands and thousands of people here at the Blackpool Air Show. I'm going to show you a picture now. Just look at all these people. You know, the thing about the Blackpool Air Show is, I went to the, the, to the Southport Air Show back in July, and you have to pay to get onto the main promenade to see the air show. You can watch it from further back, but you have to pay. I think it was something like £12. You've never had to pay for the Blackpool Air Show. It's totally free. And like I say, I say thousands, there's going to be tens of thousands of people coming to Blackpool. So I just want to give you some tips in this video on where to see it and also where you can park and where you can go for something to eat as well, I think. Check it out, the famous Central Pier and the big wheel. You know, there's such an atmosphere on there. It's so, so popular. You can just walk on the central pier and go on the rides. The kids love it on there. You know, I think that the, the piers have actually recaptured some of that magic that the Pleasure Beach has lost, you know. What do you think? I think that, yeah, because you know how you have to pay to go into the Pleasure Beach now. And it, a lot of people reckon there's hardly any, there's less people in there and there's no atmosphere like there used to be when you, when you just be, be able to walk in. I think that the piers have kind of taken that atmosphere for themselves because you can just walk onto the pier, you can go on the big wheel, you can go on the Watson, South Pier as well. So what do you think? Let me know in the comments. But anyway, all this area here in front of the tower from the central pier right up to the north pier is the main, it's the main viewing area for the air show. So the red arrows, the red arrows are going to come in, of course, over the tower. I'm not sure about the time. In fact, I'll put the times on the screen right now for you. I'll put the times and the aircraft. Obviously the Red Arrows will be performing. We're going to have a typhoon as well. We missed a typhoon at Southport. Well, I missed it anyway when I was there. But uh, hopefully we'll, we'll get the typhoon this time. So yeah, it's going to be, it's going to be pretty busy here in Blackpool this weekend. I'm not sure about the weather actually, but the weather's not, I think first, first, uh, the long range forecast not looking too bad so we'll, we'll we'll wait and see on that so we're actually going to have an air show village all the way from the central pier here we've got a spitfire on display there we've got a spitfire and a, a bowser i think it's like a refueling thing there so there's going to be plenty of stuff on the ground to see around here this is odyssey and this is uh, going to be set up for the illuminations sun's coming up behind there it's really bright what a cracking sunrise we've got this morning yeah looks like a silhouette doesn't it yeah so all the way along here is going to be we're going to have like food stalls and all sorts of stuff and when you get to the tower you know the uh, the tower headland that's going to have all the well all the main stuff you expect at a, an air show you know all the stalls and all that sort of thing anyone want a deck chair check it out a blackpool deck chair yeah, so this is how it looks. There you go, Blackpool Tower. We'll probably have the shadow of the tower on the beach, won't we? So like I said, there's going to be tens of thousands of people here this weekend in Blackpool and you're probably going to want to know where you can park. Well, there's loads and loads of parking available here in Blackpool. 
I reckon the favourite place to park for the Airshow, if you just want to park up and forget about it, is the new multi-storey car park, the Blackpool Central, which is only about a 10 minute walk from where I am here. If you're at the Central Pier and you walk straight down that road over there, Chapel Street, it takes you to the all new multi-storey central car park and if you want to get to that car park what you do is you come off the motorway you come straight off the motorway you do not turn you come straight off the m55 you come straight into central blackpool all the way and it takes you right up to the all new multi-story blackpool central car park check it out blackpool so you know i love blackpool at this time in the morning you know when it's all quiet and there's hardly anyone around no beer monsters either. Yeah, it's pretty quiet. Mind you, the uh, the promenade is starting to get quite busy now. Yeah, with traffic. Yeah, it's around about quarter to eight now. And uh, if you want something to eat during the air show, well, they're going to have loads of food stalls on the air show village. Loads and loads of food stalls. So there'll be loads of stuff to eat. But there's plenty of stuff over here as well. Plenty of local places. Don't forget about the local places. We've got traditional fish and chips just over here. We're only around the corner from the one pound burger where I am right now. It's literally five minutes walk away down there. That's down Dale Street. And we've also got Lily's Fish and Chips just over there. They're quite highly rated. Uh, if you move up the coast a little bit, we've got Papa's Fish and Chips. We've got Harry Ramsden's, all that up there. And if you fancy a walk into town, then we've got the Yorkshire Fisheries. Yeah, very, very highly rated fish and chip restaurant here in Blackpool. So if you want something to eat, don't forget that there are plenty of local places as well. Check it out, ride the Blackpool light, 27th of August. Are you coming to ride the lights? That's a really, really good event, that, yeah? They close the promenade off. This is just before they turn the illuminations on. And it's only open to electric well push bit push bikes and electric vehicles so there you go check it out ride at the blackpool lights that's another massive event going on here in blackpool put it in your diary if you get a chance there'll be again that's going to bring in thousands and thousands of people as well there you go it's all happening here in blackpool so there you go that was a bit of a public information video for you today about the upcoming Blackpool Air Show. Let me know if you're coming and if I've missed anything, if there's anything else you need to know, put a comment down below and I'll see if I can help you. But yeah, don't forget to get here early as well. The Air Show Village opens, I think it opens at 10 o'clock. It's open from 10 o'clock till 6 o'clock, the Air Show Village, yeah. And the Air Show, I think, well, it's going to be in the afternoon, isn't it? One o'clock until about five o'clock or something like that. But I've already put the information on the screen for you and it will be on a link in the description so you can check it out for yourself. But there you go, the Blackpool Air Show is this weekend. And uh, if you come in, I uh, hope you have a good time and uh, hope everything goes really well. We get to see all the planes and we don't miss any like we did at Southport, like the Typhoon. I want to see the Typhoon this time. And you never know, you might just spot me uh, knocking around somewhere. I'll be around somewhere. So there you go, that's it for this video. If you like the video, hit the like button and also hit subscribe and tick the bell for notifications of new videos. And I'll see you again on the next one.